While we're still breathing, Javi. I'm letting the bones speak to me. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh, I think I can hear them. They're saying, You're gonna lose, come mierda, so play already. I must have inherited patience from Ma. Oh, come on, man. Calm down, David. No one is ever in a rush to... Victoria. Carajo. I was so close. You're now my least favorite son, Javier. Hey, he's the one who beat you. Fine. It's a tie. I hate you both equally. Kicked out of baseball. Can't play dominoes. What exactly are you good at again, Javi? At least I can actually play baseball. Slugger. That's enough, both of you. It's not Javi's fault. He's a disgrace to the game of dominoes. I won. That's ten bucks you owe me. Both of you. I know you're broke, Javi. You should sit out the next game, since we all know I'm gonna win. No shame in surrender. Don't kid yourself. You got lucky. <sighs> Fuck luck. That was skill. Pay up, little brother. If you can. I'll cover for Javier. Oh, is it your turn to do that now? I lost track. Poor, helpless Javi. Get my wallet, mijo. Keep an eye on him. You don't want him snatching an extra 20 for gas money. It's on the counter. Yeah, sure, Pa. Pa? What's this? Hey, man, I was reading that. What? Wait, what's up? What the fuck is this? None of your business. He has cancer. What? Bob, really? I'm old. Old people get cancer. You didn't need to know. That's not for you to decide. Are you OK? I mean, are you in pain? I'm not happy. I lost a game that I knew I should have won. Ah, oh, come on. How bad? It's okay, mijo. Ask me. How bad is it? You won't have to worry about paying me back that ten bucks. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Pa. Please, settle, David. Now. You haven't told Mama. And neither will either of you. You hear me? Whatever you want, Pa. I, I won't say a word. Oh, of course, I have to be the one who tells her. Am I the only one here with any sense of responsibility? You're gonna need her help with this, Pa. Driving you to the doctor, getting prescriptions. Wait, what are your options? Treatment, stuff like that. Chemo, radiation, all that expensive mierda. Great, when do you start? I turned it down. Turned it down? You don't get to turn it down. So much money and for what? Another month. Another game of dominoes to lose? It's not worth it. If I was still playing ball, I could have paid for it. I'll pay for it. It's not happening. Save your money. Fuck the money. I can afford it. You can afford it, David. But my pride can't. Let's play another game. You are a fucking coward. A selfish coward. Javi, can you believe this shit? David, I get it, man. It's not fair, but come on, take it easy. Sit down. Both of you. You know, I pray for daughters. <laughs> Every night your mother was pregnant with both of you. Please, God, a daughter. Anything but a son. Anything but another me. Anything but another hot-headed idiot with his heart in the right place. Anything but another foolhardy, handsome gambler. Anything at all. Please, Papa, don't give up. Fight. Fight for our name, for our blood, for our family. Please, fight. It's your life, Pa. Live it however you want, or as long as you want. You're both the same, only thinking about yourselves. Don't worry, Pa. He'll come around. You should have supported him. 
Wait, what? I'm on your side. Still, I'm gonna be a name carved in stone before you know it, Javier. That'll be me. Letters on a rock that nobody wants to visit. I know you think you're strong enough to handle that alone. And so does your brother. And you're both wrong. You have to take care of each other. You two are all I'll leave behind. Like Gabe and Mariana will be for David. Legacy, Javier. It's all anyone leaves behind. That and their... bones. Be brothers. Before it's too late. That's not too much to ask. One last favor for your old man? Okay, Pa. I'll try. As hard as you can? As... as hard as I can. I still need to pay, David. Pa. Oye, if you had just won the game, we wouldn't have had this problem. <laughs> so you're blaming me for all this? I'm depending on you, mijo. We both are. must have gotten out. If something's happened to her, if you've gotten her... I thought you didn't want me around anymore. Forget about that. Kate! 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 David, wait! What's the matter with you two? Focus on your surroundings. Uh, There's Gabe and Clem. Lead the way, Hobby. Get the knee like this. Oh, nice. I got a great teacher. You guys all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Look at them. There's so many. We'll be safer inside. Get in.
That should hold them for now. You put up a good fight out there. Hey, Dad. I'm glad you made it out. Joan's probably looking for us. No, she isn't. Javi shot her. What? Good riddance. You were negotiating. I heard you. You didn't have to shoot. Everyone started panicking and shooting. We almost died. You should have listened to her. You were outnumbered. Javi's right. Joan had to go. I would have done it too. That's because you don't mind killing people, do you? Those dead guys, they were your friends. Gabe, that's not fair. Hey, you do not walk away from me. When someone speaks to you, you stand up and answer them, even if you don't want to. You are just like your Uncle Javi. I'll talk when there's someone around to defend you, spineless when there isn't. I'm just... I'm trying to protect you, Gabe. I lost you once. I won't let it happen again. Okay? We made it through alive. Let's just be glad about that. We need to check the other entrances. Make sure we're safe. Gabe, want to help me out? Javi? Gabriel! Go help him, Gabe. It's okay. He doesn't need your permission. I'll help too. O okay. Hey, Clem's with them. It's fine. It's not that. It's... let's just... <sighs> I'm all over the place. I need to focus on something. Anything. Just need to focus. On whatever. Let's just go upstairs. The further we are from these doors, the happier I'll be. I just want to get as much distance between us and the Muertos as I can. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's go. This is a fucking nightmare. Mommy, it's them. I'm glad Mariana didn't live to see this. To see what her father's become. To see what I've done. She'd be just like that little boy. Scared that the monsters are coming after her next. She would never trust us again. Kate, come on. We're not monsters. I don't know who we are anymore. But it's not the people she knew. I did this to them. That hole is there because of me. What happened was an accident. A bad one, but still. You didn't do it on purpose. But it's still my fault. I can't leave until I make this right. All of this. Let's fix this. As best we can. All right, Kate. Let's make things right. I don't know if it's actually possible. But I feel a lot better knowing you're there, too. Trip was my best friend, Javi. He died because of you. He didn't deserve this. You have no one to blame but yourself. Your actions betrayed Trip. And to think of how much he cared about you. I never thought it would be like this. You have to believe that. Everyone from Prescott is dead. Everyone but me. What's done is done. I don't have to like it. 
But I can't change it. But you... You've got a lot of nerve showing up here. After the bullshit you pulled! You're unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable! Oh! Oh, I've got a lot of nerve! Everything that happened is because of you! This is all your fault! I told you, I wanted you out of my life. After what you did to Conrad. Why did you tell Joan what we were doing? I was triaging a bad situation. Their doctor is dead. And before you guys fucked it up, their walls worked. It's not only about me. I can actually save lives here. Not just stitch them up and hope for the best. These people will die without me, Javi. I know she... Well, fucked us over. But she's trying to help them. She's trying to make something right. That's worth forgiving, right? She's trying. She's doing a good thing now. But she's got a long way to go before I forgive her. <laughs> You're one to talk. We should try to help. Not everyone here is guilty. Did you see a little girl out there? She was right behind me. I'm sorry. I haven't seen any little girls. First Rufus. Oh, my baby girl. She knew Rufus. He was her husband. Until you shot him in the back. She's one of my people, Eleanor. What's going on with her? She'll be all right. She's not bitten or anything. She lost her daughter out there. I know. I'm so sorry. Give her some privacy. It's the least we can do. I want to help you. Okay. Well... What the... We're all fucking dead because of you! Hey, easy. You We're... blew a hole in our wall! Got my little girl killed! Richmond was fine until your stupid easy ass for... showed up. We're dead fucking meat, David. Might as well take out this asshole while I can. Fern. Shut up! It was a mistake, Fern. Yeah? Well, this isn't. Stand down. That's an order. Kate, no! Fern, this is all because of me. I caused the explosion. I killed your daughter. Please, forgive me. It's my fault. Please, forgive both of us. <laughs> no! Burn! Holy shit! Wait. Oh my god! Oh my god! Dad! You're welcome, Javi. That dead guy! David, what are you doing? This isn't right! David! Oh my god! Did you really need to break her arm? That wasn't necessary! Okay? Don't thank me. No! David! Gabe! I, I, I'm sorry, that was an accident. You were going to kill her. She was going for her gun. Look at her. <laughs> Gabe, I'm... She can't even stand up. What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> Gabe. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to do that to you. You know that. Why the hell are you all looking at me that way? They're just... They're scared, David. Of what? I'm protecting them. Why are you pointing a gun at us? So I'm all alone. Fine, then. You people are on your own. I've seen that look in his eyes before. You should go after him.
David? What are you doing? Thinking it over isn't going to do you any favors. If you want to jump, just jump. Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I know the rest of them are. Right? I won't lie to you, man. You have been acting pretty scary. So you are afraid of me? You brought it on yourself, David. My wife, Javi, my son, they look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. That's enough, man. Come on. Just... just stand down, man. I didn't expect you to understand. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. Is it because I don't know how? Or because it's impossible to change who you really are? You don't have to say anything. I know what you're thinking. It's impossible. I can't change. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Just gotta live long enough to find out. Just like with anything else. I found them! They're up here! Be careful, Javi. I ran into... She was still outside when we checked on the entrances. There are muertos everywhere. We got her inside just in time. Seriously, I've never seen so many muertos. Oh, it's awful out there. <laughs> got nothing to say, huh? <laughs> You're a special kind of coward, aren't you? I guess I owe you an explanation about what happened on the stage with Joan and Tripp. You don't have to say anything to me. Your actions said plenty. I read you loud and clear, but go ahead and say whatever you want. I stand by my decision. I'd do it again. Just be glad the situation was what it was, and that she didn't make me pick between you and your brother. There's so many. They're pouring in. You don't know the half of it. The herd has taken over Richmond. The streets are filled with walkers. With that hole in the wall, this city is fucked. We're not safe here. No one is. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck have we done? So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. Stabilize the city. Figure out how to make it safer for everyone. I saw construction vehicles when we got the armored truck. We can use those to stop the Muertos, seal the breach, and save Richmond. That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. <sighs> Come on. It's an easy jump. Keep your eyes open, stay aware of your surroundings, all of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? Why was that? That can only mean one thing. 
She likes me more. Not a great time to joke around, Ami. We need to be careful up here or else the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp and do not fire your guns. We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. Everyone hold back. Let Javi and I clear out these walkers. Good to go. Let's move. You okay, bud? I was little, Dad used to ask me what I wanted to be when I was a man. And I pointed him. He always liked that. I thought he was such a great guy. It would always make him smile. Every time. Be like your uncle. He told me that all the time. Don't be a man who relies on other people to solve your problems. Because then you're not a man at all. I used to think he was right. Not anymore, though, Javi. I can only hope I grow up to be like you. I hate to admit it, but the guy may have had a point. I screwed up pretty badly, buddy. So what? You bounced back. That was wrong took such good care of me. Now we need to take care of Dad. He's the one that needs our help. We're gonna have to go around the side. There's barely any room. <sighs> no, no time to waste. Come on. You know, I didn't think there was much that could scare me anymore. And yet, here we are. Just goes to show you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Life is full of surprises. You've got to be more careful. I was being... Oh, fuck! Ah! Holy shit! Oh, my God! Ava! Fuck! God damn it, no! Let's keep going. Ava would kick my ass if she knew I was sitting around crying. We have to get across. I know Gabe doesn't see it, but David really is trying to look out for him. He's not doing the best job, but no one gives you a rule book to raise a kid. And they sure as shit don't. It's just. One thing I don't get, though. Did David really think he was helping AJ by letting him go? Why did he stop guarding him? 
He was afraid. Holding a baby in his arms probably scared him ten times more than any muerto. I don't understand. After you put in all that work, so much of your heart... AJ was a brat. He lived with me after we kicked you out, Clem. I had already raised two kids. Thought it'd be a piece of cake. <laughs> Not with that tyrant. Is that why you gave him away? We had a bad winter. Destroyed every crop we had. I couldn't leave Richmond. And AJ couldn't stay in Richmond. I gave AJ to Lingard and told him to do whatever he had to to save his life. I miss that, Brett. Never asked Lingard about it again. You should have tried harder. There's always a way. He was your responsibility. You don't get to abandon that. Don't think it doesn't haunt me. It wasn't easy, Clem. Remember, as far as I knew, I'd already lost two children. It wasn't any easier with number three. It's never easy. I'm gonna keep you alive. Keep all of us alive. And hope that that's enough. Enough for atonement. We're all abandoned one way or the other eventually. I guess AJ's no different. Holy shit. Chopped right in half. I'm not thinking it's that or go back. We should go lightest to heaviest. That way it won't break on the first swing. I'll go first, Clem. Get a long run up, but not too long. If you take too many quick steps, you'll propel yourself upward instead of out. Same with your jump. Run off the end, don't leave. David. Try not to... He's got this. She's right. I do. <sighs> Come on, Clem. Your turn. for the kids to swing across, but us? You've got this. I've seen you do things that are way scarier. Okay. I can do it. <sighs> All right, David. You're up. You're the little brother. You should go first. Oh, you're definitely lighter. We can't wait around forever.
you okay? That was quite the little ride there. I definitely can't go back now. Glad you made it. Enough. Come on. Almost there. when all we did was track the herd from a safe distance we need to get down there we're not getting anywhere without one of those vehicles it's not like we can just ask all those walkers to move out of the way how about we make some noise and distract them we could use that generator that's a great idea Gabe why don't you get so smart Gabe you really aren't the same kid I remember Hey, don't give him too big of a head. He's still got some learning to do. Don't listen to him, Gabe. You're doing just fine. We still gotta get to the generator somehow. Cut a walker open and cover yourself with its guts. Then you can slip right through them. Oh, that's a great idea. Gross idea, but... great. I could have saved my water bottle. So, who's going to do it? Javi, you've been willing to do some crazy stuff for me before. I know shooting Conran wasn't easy, but it showed me I can always depend on you. Of course, Clem. Look, it smells really bad. Like, way worse than you think. <sighs>
You did it, Javi. Barely. Now that we're here, we gotta find something to seal the breach with. All we need is the right vehicle. Oh, that's not gonna do the job, man. Yes, it is. What are you doing? The right thing. I'm leaving. We're all leaving. What? And going where? You saw it yourself. We're surrounded by the herd. I'm taking my family out of here. You helped keep them safe, Clem. You're coming too. Let's go. Everyone. We can't wait around. This is bullshit, David. Absolutely not. Everyone in Richmond will die without us. They don't matter, Javi. Don't you get that? This all started the day we knocked on Richmond's door. We brought this on these people, all of us. We can't abandon them. Not after what we've done. We're going home, Kate. Back to the last place we were a family. We're starting over. We're all together again. Finally. It's time. All of us. A new day. A new life. But what about here, man? Make Richmond our new home. Richmond is gone, Javi. I'm not gonna let the people I love die trying to save a dead dream. I'll go with you, Dad. Gabe! He's my father, Clem. I'm sorry, but you really wouldn't understand. Think this over, buddy. Gabe, is this what you really want? I know it's scary out there, but I have to. You don't have to be afraid, Gabe. I won't let what happened to Mariana happen to you. You have my word. I will protect you the right way. I'm not missing another minute with my family now. This is what I want. I... I understand, Gabe. I'm still going back. I won't be able to live with myself if I don't try to help the people in Richmond. You won't be able to live at all if you do that. Richmond is compromised. It doesn't matter if there were five of us trying to save it or 500. We'd all die. I know a losing battle when I see one. We're moving out. Everybody get in. That's an order. How fucking dare you? What will it take, David? What will it take to show you that you do not get to do that? We are not your soldiers. Run away home. Be a deserter. I am done with you. Let's go, Javi. Why the fuck do you think he would go with you? Tell him. What the fuck is this? I love her, man. We're in love. I should have known. I should have known the night Pa died. The night you weren't there. Blood is worthless to you. Just like he was to you. Just like I am to you. Well, it's time for you to finally learn what blood really means. David! Dad! What do you have to say for yourself, brother? David! Stop it!
David! What the hell is he doing? David took him. We can't wait any longer. We have to go help Richmond. I'm getting on that bulldozer. But Gabe! Gabe wanted to go. He did. We all heard it. You're... you're right. I'm going to save Richmond. Someone has to. Let's split up, Hobby. I'll go after Gabe on that motorcycle if you don't. Otherwise, I'll go with Kate on the bulldozer. Are you sure you'll be okay without me? I can take care of myself. We're out of time. Javi, I'm sorry. I've been here before, more than once. It's not gonna end well for everyone. You have to decide. I can't let Kate go by herself. It's too dangerous. I'm going with Kate to save the city. <sighs> okay, then I'll go after Gabe. It's a smart idea. Be careful out there, Clem. You too. Both of you. If we're gonna drive into the herd, we're gonna need these. Side. Can you help us get the gate open? Almost didn't recognize you, Jesus. Once I got in contact with my people, I headed right back. Had to make sure you folks were safe. I think I'm getting the hang of this. We'll keep the muertos away. Just get me to the gate so I can open it up. We're almost there! Hobby, get in the bus kit and I'll lift you to the top of the gate! Bus kit? The thing in the front! The scooper thing! Whatever! Get in it! Yuck! Hobby! The busket! Right! Yeah, busket! Nice of you folks to drop by! Open gate button. You did it, Javi! Bingo. Let's get inside and wrangle the walkers together. If we get them in one group, we can lead them right out. Steam ahead.
Let's get out of here. Jesus, over here. We need to round up these walkers. Head them towards the cave. Welcome back. I thought we were coming back to, uh... Well, not to this. It's just a little surprising. That's all. This? Huh, this is just another Tuesday in Richmond. We need to get it under control. Trouble in one place usually finds its way to another. Javi, look! It's Clem! Gabe? Is he...? No, no, he's fine. He's just banged up. What happened, Clem? Their car got overrun with walkers and crashed. I was barely able to save Gabe. What about David? David's dead. I'm just glad you found Gabe in time. Thank you. David's dead, huh? I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, that's that, I suppose. When I got there, it looked like David had turned. And that Gabe had to... stop him. Oh, God. Gabe. It's horrible. Javi? My... my dad... he... I know, buddy. He's... he's gone. No, no. He wanted me to tell you. Take care of each other. Where did you find them? A little ways outside of town. Not too far. Can you take Gabe somewhere safe? Yeah, sure. Come on, Javi. Where are we going? A funeral. God. Poor David. Poor Gabe. I can't imagine. He talked about this every day. What to do when he died. He was convinced it would happen in the field. Every day. As common as talking about the weather. Then be happy, David. You got what you wanted. More than you realize. He'd talk about his military funeral the way that other people talked about retirement plans. He'd only change the subject if I promised I'd bury these. He didn't care about burying his body. As far as he was concerned, this was him. Help me dig. It doesn't have to be much. We should probably say something. That's what you do, usually. When you see Pa, you tell him I said hi. And then I'm sorry for not paying you back that 10 bucks. Do you, uh, you want to say something?
Let's go. It was his own fault. If you regret helping me, if you're feeling any guilt, bury it. I mean it. Don't let it eat you up inside. We need to move on. Move forward. We do. And we will. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still though, I feel more calm here than... than I ever did in an old van on streets with no streetlights. We earned this, Javi. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. A fresh start. What do you say? I think it'd be good for us. You're on. Let's start a family. You don't think it's selfish? It's not the safest world outside of Richmond. Or inside it, truth be told. So long as I got you, I'm not too worried about it. be up there before we know it. Better do something worthwhile in the meantime. Head now? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. Gotta move on. I gotta admit, man, you're a fucking badass. You're a real charmer. You know that, through and through. Are you really sure you don't want to stay? There's room. Oh, <laughs> I'm sure there is. But we got other people depending on us, Avi. Just the way it is. I was worried about you, Javi. About who you are inside. You helped save these people, though. That goes a long way for me. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be if you let it. Trust me, though. Life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like Joan. You gotta do the right thing. Always. Good days, and especially bad. Absolutely. The right thing, no matter what. Good to hear. I read people pretty well. Little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change, and I think you should. For the better. God knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better hands than it was. Hey. Uh, Jesus? Hey, uh, Gabe. Thanks for, you know, not letting me get killed. 
and for coming back to help us. Yeah, thanks for that, man. Pay it forward. Be vigilant. Trouble never stays too far away. So you're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. I have to find AJ, Javi. I've waited so long. But could you do me one last favor before I leave? to do this for my niece. That's nice of you. She thought I was terrible at it. Were you? Not your business. I'm really gonna miss Gabe. I mean, he's super annoying sometimes, but I've gotten used to having him around. At least to have someone to talk to, even if he is a total dork. Not that he said anything to me in particular, but you know the guy's got a mondo crush on you, right? <sighs> he does not. Oh my gosh, you have a crush on him too. I do not. Well, you both have my blessing. <laughs> I'm gonna stab you with those scissors. I have to see AJ Javi. I have to see that he's okay. Do you think he remembers me? At least a little? Maybe? Who could forget you, Clem? No one who knew you, I guarantee it. Yeah, maybe. Everyone told us he was better off. After everything that's happened, I'm starting to think they're right. I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I can't stop thinking about it. I really wish I could. Did you love him? With all of my heart. And of course you were. Gabe told me you used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up, too. Yep. Sure did. Well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? If you really loved it, how? I'd really like to tell you that it fades away and you just you get over it. But when you really love it, you never do. Not really. <sighs> yeah, that sounds about right. All done. Well, how's it look? You know what? I'll grab your hat. <laughs> I remember this team. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, you come back, and I'll tell you all about it. It's a deal. If I bring AJ back with me, will you teach him too? You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. Bring him back.
There's never enough light to blind me. you, AJ. 